Hey, what's going on everybody? Uh, we're back in the wood shop today and we're gonna be playing around with my new Osmo Mobile 3. Um, I kind of like it. I like that it has active track so I can kind of be in the wood shop and I can kind of show you guys what I'm doing uh, without necessarily always having to be like, hey, here's with my hands. All right, so the active track so far, this isn't a review on it, but it's kind of frustrating. So right now it already lost my face. So if you are not like, staring into the camera the entire time it'll lose your face but anyway that's not what this video is about today we are gonna be hammering out um well no prepping out all of our details for our shelving units inside of our trailer we're still about two weeks out from getting our trailer so i want to have everything built before we have the trailer so that way whenever we get it boom we have a build day two build days everything squared away and we're ready to roll all right so let's look at what we're looking at all right, so here is our shelf. So uh, I just got done doing a little bit of planer work on that. So I'm not the best planesman, I guess, if you want to call it that. But that's what we are going to do. So we're trying to keep these very simple. Uh, oh, hang on. Let me get this. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right, we're trying to keep these shelving units very simple. So as you can see, we're gonna have our refrigerator under here. And what I'm planning on doing is getting our water tank uh, is gonna be located right here. We're gonna have our water filtration system and water pump in this. And then right here, right here, we're gonna have our espresso machine. Right here, we're gonna have our drip. Uh, over here, we're gonna have our grinder and right there is our kegerator so we'll have our cold brew station set up right here with all of our cold brew goodies that we're going to need oh sorry i'm moving the camera around way too much i'm trying to learn this gimbal all right and then right here is going to be our super simple setup for our hot coffee so i'm going to have a 2.2 liter uh, i guess like a air pot is what they're called right here and then I'll have the cups right here or actually probably I'll have the actual air pot sitting right here we'll have the little hot sleeves we'll have the cups we'll have the different flavors so if somebody wants you know hazelnut or whatever then uh, that's what we're gonna do uh, then I've built in some extra shelving down here so we can hold extra cups extra stuff and I'm still trying to figure out how we're gonna keep stuff from bouncing around uh, we're thinking totes right now and yeah little tiny like totes and containers oh we're planning on that to keep it simple so this is our inventory setup uh, i've never seen anybody talk about that so i'll make a video on that one day but here's our inventory all right so like i said i'm gonna be messing around with this gimbal today so uh oh come here we're gonna go this way better lighting all right so i'm gonna be messing around with this gimbal today so be patient with me um, in these next couple videos because I got to learn I got to learn what I'm doing um, I like it so far but again this is not what the video is about so anyway I'll shut up let's get to work Okay, after about an hour of sanding, we got that finished. So now we're gonna move on to painting. So we have a really dark latex paint that we're gonna use um, for the actual shelves. And then the tops are gonna be lightly stained with like a honey color. And then we're gonna put about 17 coats of shellac over it. Uh, so it'll maintain its waterproofness. Um, pretty easy, not too hard. Everybody can do this, I think so. All right, here we go. So here is 
the shelves. Initial painting. I gotta go to yoga, so I can't finish, but that's what they're gonna look like. And then the top is gonna be like a honey color. Um, All right, we're back from yoga. So that means it's time to start uh, painting again. Woo. All right, so today is over. Well, the work that I'm gonna do today is over. Uh, so we went ahead and did um, all the paint, sanding, painting. I'm gonna go ahead and let this get really dry and then tomorrow I'm gonna do the staining. Um, so for the staining, we're just doing like a, like I said, just a pine color, uh, cause pine stand coffee company. So we're trying to have like, you know, pine tabletops. And then like I said, we're gonna shellac the given good gracious out of it. Um, so that way, you know, we, you know, drips are going to happen and, um, it can hopefully be uh, drip proof or something like that. Um, anyways, guys, Hey, I know this is just a quick video, but I want to keep you guys, uh, along for the journey. So if you are along for the journey, appreciate it. Um, hit the like button, subscribe, tell people, Hey, you know, these crazy dudes are out here doing something and, um, I really appreciate your, uh, support and if you're in camp lejeune or north carolina hit us up and uh we can uh get together man drink some coffee all right anyways have a good one